Cook's Corner is on the road today. We are in Salem at Barron's Major Brands and we have Liz from the Creative Feast joining us today. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I love watching you work. So Thank what are you doing? You. Okay, so right now we are making two low carb side dishes because I'm interested in finding as many ways to serve low carb foods. So okay. here is mashed cauliflower replaces mashed potatoes. Right. Okay, very yeah. few carbs, has the same texture. We're going to add the same things, butter, cream cheese, salt, pepper, all the things you love. And it's kind of like that blank palette so you can kind of oh, make it what you want. Absolutely. Correct? And then here I have my um, cauliflower um, rice. So this is my little ricer. I'm actually going to do a little bit of, yeah, a little bit of carrots because I want to add some color, but you can add any vegetables you want to your fried rice. I love toys. Yes. That's a great one. This you got to pick up one of those. Amazon. <laughs> I don't know the brand name. It's a uh, gourmet slicer or something. So Very nice. I think 20 bucks. So in here, I have my um, Cauliflower. The key is is not to overcook it. Remember that it's you know doesn't need that much. We're just going to heat it through. Okay. Um, drop my cauliflower right in here. But you could do this if you had a um, grater, a regular box grater. Okay. You could do it. Yeah. You can even Absolutely. buy it that way, and some people buy it frozen. <laughs> so there we go. That Still easy. Fast. Yes. And um, and so I'm just going to saute that up and add some salt and pepper. You can add, I'm using butter, but if you wanted to use olive oil, sure. you could do that, avocado oil. Taste. Yep, um, everything to taste. And you know, this is really important that we get more familiar with these options for low carb because when we take the carbs down in our diet, it allows our body to shift over to consuming the fats that we may have tucked in a little over here and a little over here. Yeah, I got more spaces yeah. than that, but well, yeah, I know what you go. mean. There yeah. you go. But, <laughs> you know, I mean, in two and a half years, I've lost 25 pounds. Congratulations. My yes, energy, awesome. thank you, my energy re level is through the roof. I've even started to do some intermittent fasting. See, now that is something that I think a lot of folks would think yes. is difficult but you say not so much. Not so much, especially if you started to reduce the carbohydrates in your diet. If you can do that first, give yourself a couple of weeks, get used to that idea of not having cereal for breakfast or oatmeal for breakfast. Mm. Go to the savory side of the foods. You could even eat leftovers from this for breakfast. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Then once you do that, then you can start you know, doing longer fasts. Believe it or not, every one of us fasts at night when we go to mm -hmm. sleep. So, that is very yes, true. Yes, yes, yeah. Liz, tell us real quickly, for anybody who's interested in what you do and they want to hear more from you, how can they find you? Well, you can go to my website, thecreativefeast.com. I may be in your area. I do these programs at libraries all over New Hampshire, Massachusetts. I do them at um, schools for employees. I do them in corporate settings. Mm. All of that information is there. All right, Liz, thank you so much thank for your you. time. Thank Stay you. tuned. We'll be right back.